to this video and in this video I'm going to be showing off the new quick match mode in GTA uh, G fucking hell, I can't talk I feel like absolute shit at the moment I'll explain that later and I'm going to be showing off the new game mode quick match in Gran Turismo 6 I especially like this mode it's so, it's so good it suit it pretty much suits everyone so pretty much a lowdown on the game mode and why I am actually particularly like this is because Different sets of races with different sets of laps, different sets of cars, but everyone's in the in roughly the same category of car, and they're all stock. So you, everyone has got the set that the same amount of um, advantage. So no one's got like extremely fast cars, and some have got extremely slow cars. You're all on a level playing ground, if you get what I'm saying. I'm gonna go for the scuba. Um, sports car whatever the fuck it was this one i have been doing a couple of times because obviously this is the one that took my fancy and i think they changed because uh when the update came out there's a few different ones i think there was a there was a small car one which is gone um uh but i did have a go at the with the honda nsx and then i had a go with the nissan skyline but in all fairness i would take I would take the Honda the NSX over the um, over the Skyline. I know it's slower, but it's just a lot nicer and better to race. All right, so we're on this game mode. Um, it wasn't going to really be a, a video where I show off the game mode, but I might as well as at the moment. So what you do is you get put in this mode here as you are now, um, and then I think you either wait till you get put into a game with people random people so you don't choose what game as as it is now yeah matchmaking complete waiting for other players so it's put you in a game so then once you're in a game you can go up into warm-up mode which is you can just cruise around the track practice before the race starts with this over open lobbies um, the difference is the person that's the owner of the lobby doesn't start the race. The game automatically just starts the race and you have a certain amount of time to practice before the race starts. Then, you know, the race starts. So, yeah, as you can see, the race starts in 145 seconds and it's counting down. And until then, you can click warm-up mode and you can just race around the track uh, to have a warm-up, as it says. I could let you into the secret of me starting these because so many people jump the start and get bloody uh, full start. So many people. There's a, there's a trick to doing it. I'm not going to tell you straight away. I'll let you guess to start off with. And I might tell you. I might tell you at the end of the video. Here we go. There we go, as you can see that person did a full start, and I did not do a full start, because I know a trick in doing it. Uh, so I'm running uh, automatic, with sports hard tyres, and obviously the car's stock, so you can't do anything to the engine. And I think I've got traction control on, I don't know what, what number, but I know I've got ABS of 1. And no, you don't have to have traction control way off and ABS off because this ain't nothing serious. It's just a nice public match where you're all on par. Maybe take, maybe obviously, uh, I never have the traction control for drifting. Fucking hell, my friend the other day told me he drifts in automatic in a tank car, and he was actually getting decent scores on to sco on this track to scuba. I was like. When he said he drifted in fucking automatic, I was like, what the fuck? How the fuck can you drift on automatic? Come on, step the game up, step the game up. Oh, fucking Skyline. There we go, that's what I mean. They're fucking fast, but they just fucking hold, hold everyone up. See you later, Skyline. Wanker. Try hitting me off. I'm not gonna get as rowdy as you said, as I explained. I feel like shit. Don't go off the track. Come 
Come on, let's get past this Lancer. Fucking hell, I went too much on the fucking curb. Slowed myself down. And even the Lancer able to go past me. Wow. Look at the skids, like... Alright, let's make this lap let's make this lap worth it. Past the lance we go, past the lance we go. Through the lance we go. Fucking runny nose is doing my head in. I can't fucking concentrate. Past the SDR. Wank can even look where he's going when he's coming back on the track. Come on, let's at least get past this fucking Australian in the fucking SDI. Come on, let's get past the STI. Let's get fourth. Let's at least get fourth. Come on, past the STI. Fucking STI! Look where you're fucking driving! I said I wasn't going to get rowdy, but when STI. You wang! Right, right, I'm going to get in front of the STI. I'm gonna get four. I got four. Could have probably got fucking ass that fucking STI didn't try hitting me off the track. Maybe I'll come back and do another video when I don't feel like shit and actually. I might actually have my A game. What well, I advise you if you ever get into YouTube, if you feel like absolute shit, do not edit a video because it's not a good thing to do. You cannot concentrate at all when editing a video.